Kay Carey and I run the co-op scholarship program at, here at UNSW. Um, what's co-op? Co-op's an industry sponsored scholarship program uh, that is designed to give some of our best and brightest students um, experience in industry and professional development before they, or while they're at university, before they start their careers, as the basis for developing that professional potential so that they hit the ground running when they go into the workforce. The relationship between NIDA and the co-op program started 14 years ago. We had our first conversations with NIDA in 2009. Um, and we ran our first full program in 2010. Uh, and we've been running the program ever since. And that's a testament to how successful it's been for us and for our students. So we arrived and then we started off the day with um, just some general sort of like movement activity to get us in um, the mood to collaborate with one another and also to learn. So um, just some very basic movement exercises. I think we did lots of around the room, just walking and like talking to each other. And then after that, we sort of specified um, certain areas of the program. So we focused one on body language and stance and how that um, projects our opinions and our thoughts to the audience. Um, and we also learnt how to use our voice to communicate effectively. And then at the end, we were also able to see how storytelling sort of plays into presentation. So when you're actually presenting a speech or you're presenting a piece of information, if you need to improvise or you need to engage your audience, you have specific techniques that you can like refer to or improvise um, certain aspects if you see your audience like losing interest or getting distracted. So I hadn't really thought about how to look neutral for example that was something we did with NIDA and that's a very important skill when you're giving a presentation in the workplace. Take the time to think about your body language when you're intending to be neutral because if you're not thinking about it at all I promise it's not neutral. So the stuff at NIDA sort of refined um, and challenge my personality and to grow and to connect with other people in a group, other like-minded people as well. And just to be able to use those skills sets into an environment where you're working as a team and you're collaborating on not just like a small project, but a big project. And to be able to use those skills and grow as an individual. It's been a very successful partnership. NIDA captures their imagination. They learn that public speaking is a skill is a capability that you can learn, that you can improve, and that you can improve by practice. I would describe NIDA corporate training as a great opportunity for you to grow your communication skills, your presentation skills, also allow you to become a more confident person because you are pushing yourself out of your comfort zone. And it also is great for you connecting with others and learning how to collaborate with all different sorts of people.